कोर्स इंजीनियरिंग ड्राइंग वन यूनिट टू कंप्यूटर एडेड ड्राफ्टिंग आफ्टर अटेंडिंग द सेशन यू विल बी एबल टू आउटलाइन द एडवांटेजेस ऑफ कैड एक्सप्लेन हार्डवेयर एंड अदर डिवाइसेस एक्सप्लोर द बेसिक शेप्स एंड ऑब्जेक्ट्स अंडरस्टैंड द कोऑर्डिनेट सिस्टम डिस्क्राइब द ऑटो कैड पैकेज एक्सप्लेन स्टार्टिंग ऑफ ऑटो कैड डिस्क्राइब वेरियस कमांड्स इन ऑटो कैड एंड इट्स यूसेज इंट्रोडक्शन कंप्यूटर एडेड डिजाइन कैड इज यूज इन वेरियस इंडस्ट्रीज फॉर डिजाइनिंग रियल और वर्चुअल ऑब्जेक्ट्स कैड इज वाइडली यूज बाय डिजाइनर्स फॉर टेक्निकल एंड इंजीनियरिंग ड्रॉइंग्स कैड ड्रॉइंग्स एंड कंप्यूटर असिस्टेड पार्ट्स आर यूज इन ऑटोमोटिव शिप बिल्डिंग एरोस्पेस एंड आर्किटेक्चुरल डोमेन कैड ऑफर्स वेरियस बेनिफिट्स इन कंपेरिजन टू म्यूचुअल ड्राफ्टिंग CAD drawings can be modified as per requirements with minimum processing time. The primary benefit of using CAD in industry is an increase in productivity in designers. Designers can produce drafts with CAD much faster than the conventional drafting techniques so that the designers can introduce their design and launch their products into the market quickly with best quality. advantages of cad the cad system provides its application in various fields it is widely used in automobile aviation and marine sectors the cad system provides a variety of benefits to industries in making designs of the products to be produced as per need these benefits are listed as follows increases the accuracy and productivity of a product enables easy design alterations requires shorter correction time for drawing offers better drawing view with the help of colors provides boolean operations for solid modeling boundary representations allows drafting models efficiently reduces the amount of wastage in drawing papers enables easy storage and retrieval of drawings transfers drawings in cheaper and faster way enables to perform revisions enables auto code generation through cnc converters allows in customizing the product enables to create orthographic projections with dimensions hardware and other devices the hardware and other devices used in cad are explained as follows input devices keyboard mouse output devices dot matrix printer laser printer basic shapes and objects in autocad you can draw various objects such as linear and curved by using various commands linear objects are drawn with a line which is the most basic thing in a drawing you can draw various linear objects such as lines polylines rectangles polygons multi lines or free hand sketches curved objects are the objects whose direction of motion can be changed these objects can be in the form of arcs circles polylines arcs donuts ellipses and splines coordinate system the coordinate system is based on scale and numbering coordinates consist of three numbered scales the x axis y axis and z axis which are perpendicular to each other coordinates are frequently used on the drawing page to set the size and location of objects move and copy objects and align objects relative to each other the 2d drafting and end notation workshops contains various options that depend on the location and orientation of ucs which are as follows absolute and relative coordinate entry of an object absolute reference angles for an object definition of horizontal and vertical axis for the ortho mode polar tracking object snap tracking grid display and grid snap options orientation of horizontal and vertical dimensions of an object orientation of text objects 
in the following section you learn to enter 2d and 3d coordinates and direct distances for an object on the drawing page entering 2d coordinates while working on a 2d drawing you need to enter the x and y coordinates for drawing 2d objects a 2d drawing contains two coordinate values x axis and y axis you can use the following types of coordinates in 2d cartesian coordinates polar coordinates entering 3d coordinates 3d cartesian coordinates which include three coordinate values x y and z 3d coordinates can also be specified as absolute coordinates or relative coordinates the only difference between 2d and 3d coordinates is that 3d coordinates include the z axis autocad package autocad is a computer aided designing and drafting software which helps you to design and develop almost all imaginable shapes in the world it is officially supported by all window vista versions except home basics in addition it is not compatible with 32 bit and 64 bit windows xp professional and window xp home a major advantage of autocad 2009 is that it reduces the number of steps needed to perform a task starting with autocad the dwg drawing file is the most important file of autocad since it contains all the objects that you draw in autocad including style and layer definitions and the properties associated with graphical objects by default autocad creates a backup of a drawing file every time the drawing is saved and renames the copy as file name dot bak some external files are needed to open a drawing file in autocad these include the following the shx or ttf file or both used to install different fonts pat files used to implement hatch patterns lin files used to implement line type patterns ctb or stb files used to draw plot style tables various commands in autocad and its usage autocad is equipped with very useful commands to make your work easily while drawing You can draw, edit and modify any object on the drawing page with the help of these commands. You can modify shapes with the help of following commands. Create and combine regions. The copy command, the rotate command, the offset command, the mirror command, the move command, the scale command, the array command, the fillet and chamfer command. the break and join command summary outline the advantages of cad explain hardware and other devices explore the basic shapes and objects understood the coordinate system described the autocad package explained starting of autocad described various commands in autocad and its usage